Before we get into today's video, I wanted to quickly thank AOA.com for sponsoring this channel. AOA is a great place to get all of your Rocket League items including wheels, crates, keys, and much more. Use coupon code JSPADE to save 3% at checkout. Alright, hello YouTube! It is Jack Wall Spade. Um, I am filming this on OBS because first off I have to leave for work in 18 minutes here and also you know it's not something that's really going to require much editing but the other day uh, a good friend of mine, Mr. Person, came to me and made me aware of a situation that I guess I you know really didn't know much about um apparently there's been some price manipulation going on with white phantasmo for the dominus um that is an rlcs decal from a while back and uh you know it's really been hurting some people um i think i've got a gray phantasmo or something like that that i can quickly show you guys but uh, in any case, um, people have been trying to act like it is much more expensive than it actually is. Um, I am not on trading sites too much these days, so uh, I really don't, you know, get a chance to uh, see stuff like this when it develops, so it really does make a difference for you guys to make me aware of it. But um, what's been going on is people have been trying to charge absolutely ridiculous prices for for the white version of this Phantasmo decal. Uh, in reality, I think it's only about 10 keys or so, and people have been trying to charge absolutely ridiculous prices. So, as Mr. Person says here, uh, some of the people involved are uh, Doroji and um, uh, Powsey Wrangler. Uh, apparently Doroji actually has some clips on his profile of him uh, scamming people this way and getting way too much for the decal. Uh, at this point, I think I'm going to go ahead and switch over to my display capture so you guys can see on uh, rockets-league.com. Uh, um, the most recent post is from somebody who is actually calling out the people who are price manipulating and trying to get way too much for it. But if you go back a little bit, you'll see some of these people are asking for key offers, you know, just trying to uh, lure people into paying more than they should for it, even if they're not being specific about it. And then other people are being very specific specific about what they want, saying, you know, I want a white Zamba and ad for this stupid 10 key decal. Uh, other people are saying, uh, you know, key offer, and you know, you can already tell that this guy is uh, a little sketchy because his gamer tag does not match what uh, he's actually asking people to message. Um, but it's just really stupid, you know, some people are asking 50 keys for it, uh, some people are asking uh, freaking 200 keys or uh, white octane. Some really stupid stuff. Uh, BCB Destroyer is one of the people doing it right there. So you can see, you know, it really makes no sense. It's very stupid and uh, it's not something that anybody should be falling for. Um, definitely don't think that uh, item prices are going to rise this quickly and, you know, definitely don't think that there's going to be uh, this big of a variety on what people are asking if it actually is expensive, you know? If some old uh, item was to go up in price, um, it would be pretty clear-cut what that price is. There wouldn't be people asking 500 keys for one and then people asking 200 plus keys for the other. So, you know, I just wanted to make you guys aware of this, just let you know. Um, again, in general, uh, just try and stay away from scammers, you know? When things seem too good to be true, often they are. Um, if anybody's ever offering to pay you more than something's worth and, you know, they're offering it 
in some sort of sketchy way where you have to send first or they only send half, you know, really stupid stuff. Just uh, make sure that you don't get scammed. Always use a middleman if you're uh, doubting and make sure that that middleman is verified. Try and get one through the spreadsheet. I know Sweaty Finger is a really great middleman. He's a good friend and uh, a bunch of other people. I mean, you can get them on Reddit. You can get them on Facebook all over the place. So uh, just be careful. And for me personally, remember, I am literally never going to ask for donations. Um, I am never going to claim to be myself on a separate account. Um, you know, the, the only account that I'm ever going to be interacting with subscribers through is my main Jack of All Spade account. So if anybody looks like me and is claiming to be me, don't believe it. You know, literally just message my main account and say, hey, is this you? The answer is probably going to be no, because I, I really don't want to confuse people by starting to talk to people through other accounts. You know, it's always going to be through my main account. So just keep that in mind. I think at this point, we're going to go ahead and wrap it up. But I appreciate you guys watching this always. Please be careful out there. And I will catch you guys on the next one.